The wheels on the Mars rover go round, round and, and round. round. Round and round. round. round, and round. The round wheels and on the Mars rover go round, round and round. round. Wait, hold up. How is the engine working on Mars? That, that uh, No explosions, right? What the? I'm not entirely sure. Guys, here today we're on Mars. Have you looked at your top right? We have Earth all the way back there. Isn't it beautiful? Well, today we are doing a new verse pro first. Wait, guys, shut, shut the vehicle off. It's not on. Ah! Uh, uh, ah! Hello? Hello? It's an alien. It's an alien. It's a Martian. It's a Martian. Wait, guys, I, I think I know who this is. The I'm getting a blaster. Car. They sent it into space. It's got to be Elon Musk, dude. Oh, Hello, everyone. I am Elon Musk. It... What? what? You... They did Post send him meme up. Post meme review! Meme review. Let's go. Let's get it. Where's this Wait, memes? but this is a Mercedes. Don't ask questions. If my Tesla was not... It was in the shop. So I, uh... Took the, did, uh... Did you fly all the way from Earth on that? The Benz, you know you what I mean? Watch the live stream, dude. They sent it all the way into space. It was insane. But well, I thought they had a dummy in there. Was that Elon well, I, all the time? I... All this time? Well, yeah, it was me. I was on the ship, and I actually hid it in the trunk. That's weird. But all right, well, guys, today we are doing a new verse pro versus hacker versus god Mars base challenge. Whether you're building Elon Musk a spaceship or a Mars base or Mars rover, whatever you want to build, you will be in the contest. If you build anything other than those four things, then you're out. What? You can, you cannot build PewDiePie. It's not a Mars PewDiePie video. I'm liking this. If you do no want to see gravity. more videos here in space, make sure you leave a like right now. And yes, there is no gravity. Well, there's little gravity. We can, we can, we can bounce. Very Who wants to play basketball? Me. Basketball on Mars would be so... Oh! Go I'm deep, boys. Help. Go deep. <gasps> don't throw it to me. Please don't. Stay on for three. <laughs> Kobe! Ow! Ow! <laughs> Hit me in the face! How Elon, catch All this right. ball! All right, there's still pain on Mars, confirmed. Yes, guys, we are building something on Mars, and I have the perfect idea because I've been wanting to do this for a while. I want to make a spaceship, and we're going to point it upwards towards Earth because I don't like Mars. I don't like the low gravity thing. I like having normal gravity and my bones don't get all all liquefied or whatever if you stay on here for too long but anyways guys welcome back to another new verse purpose hacker we are going to build the most epic spaceship of all time we're going high fantasy high science it's not going to be like any spaceship you've ever seen before now first we're going to find the blocks and i haven't done that yet so let me just do that real quick actually yeah, let me just do that real quick, and I'll be right back. I'm going to have all the blocks, and then we're going to start on this build. One sec. All right, there we go. Now that we have all our blocks that I kind of want to use, just the beginning blocks we can use, we can start laying out the build. So we're going to first find the middle, because we're going to use a lot of uh, CS rotating world data here, and that'll make our job really easy and make everything go pretty fast. So we can probably make a pretty crazy spaceship uh, in no time at all. So at, uh, the first thing I want to do is make a like a, uh, the legs of it. So the legs I think I want to make out of do, 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 this texture. And maybe we just gotta find out how far we want the spaceship to be. Um, here, let's make this first. So this will be the base right here. So everything below the base is gonna be gone. So we're gonna make the base right here. Here's the middle of it. So let's make the, the this, and then let's do uh, some more textures here. I think will be needed. So maybe we can do this texture right here, because these this is where all the legs are gonna kind of meet. So let's do an iron thing right there, uh, and then another texture up here. And then we're just gonna build this up and we'll probably just see us rotate this around 900 times and it will be good from there. So let's go ahead and grab the middle, stink, and put that right there, put that right there. And then we're gonna see us rotate this around 900 times. Now, we're gonna make the legs. Um, maybe this should be higher actually, since it's so, it's bigger than I thought it was gonna be. So let me put this, go ahead and make this make, uh, geez, I am stuttering over my words. We're gonna push it up like 10 blocks maybe. Let's see, 10. Uh, I don't know, that's pretty high. Let's move it up only seven. There we go. Move seven. Sorry, I'm, I'm talking fast because whenever I build, I like kind of, I just have ideas flowing at the same time as I'm talking. It's kind of weird. I sometimes stumble over my words. Hopefully it doesn't bother you guys too much. But here is going to be a, uh, a foot. So let's make that an iron block. Because this is a speed build, you know, we got we to gotta beat them. 
I'm pretty I'm pretty consistent at being the uh, the first one to be done, so I'm pretty proud of that. Uh, so we're gonna keep on speed build. So let's go ahead and grab that, and then this I made too far, so let's go move this like five in. Okay, we're getting we're getting closer. Let's go ahead and move it seven in. Uh, I'm just trying to get the the um, what's it called the uh, scale of it correct. So we're gonna go ahead and select this block. We're gonna use voxel sniper here, and we're going to make a line. Okay, my arrow just disappeared, so let me go ahead and re-grab that. An arrow and a gunpowder, so let's go ahead and grab this, and then we're going to, hopefully this is air. Let me turn on chat just for this one little thing. Okay, yes, it is air. Okay, that's good. Well, I hope it wasn't like space or something, some weird block, but we're going to go ahead and connect the leg with this material on the bottom of the base. So let's go ahead and select that, and then boom. Um, what, uh, what? Tile Mars... Let's see what happens. Oh, there we go. Okay, so it's it's been it's been a little weird. So let's go ahead and uh, select this as the first point, and then down here should work. Um, it seems there are some weird blocks blocking my way through. Um, Voxel sniper is being a little strange, guys. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna lie. So let's go ahead and select that again. And then, yep, it's being sweet. So we're gonna have to, we're just gonna have to hand do it. It's not that hard. We're just gonna go all the way down, straight down, make it match what kind of what we were going for anyway. Um, there we go. And then we'll go straight down right there. Okay, so now we just gotta make kind of the shape of the leg. I want it to curb in a little bit, so we're gonna do that right there. And then we will probably connect this with a wall, just because I think it'll look pretty cool if we do this watch. Kind of just bring that down a little bit. So we have our first initial little leg going thing, uh, going thingy, and then now we're gonna make basically make a, sh uh, a shape out of it. Now it's a flat plane right now, but we're gonna make a nice kind of shape where uh, the middle is kind of skinnier than where it meets the the foot, I guess. So let's go ahead and fill this foot in with the iron blocks. We'll go ahead and cop. We're gonna delete that, copy that right there, and we'll copy this over. Uh, right here, position two, and let's go ahead and flip that to the other side. So we're gonna copy that and flip to the right. Uh, we'll probably need to flip to the right around the player. There we go. So that's gonna work. Now we're gonna make this side up here thicker. Maybe with this extra block right here, we can use factory block right here. Um, so let's just make that design. That way it connects with the base a little better and just doesn't like one block connect to it. Something weird like that. <laughs> So now let's also connect, let's also have a kind of a, uh, a gap right there. And then so this will go up a little bit like that as well. Oh man, this is, this is going a little weird. Uh, let's just bring this up a little bit to here. I'm just trying to find the right balance for this leg. Um, so maybe... Maybe it just needs to be inward a little bit, to be honest. So let's go ahead and grab the entire thing, and we'll just move it in maybe like two blocks, and we'll see what this looks like, see if it fixes the problems that I'm having with it visually. So let's go ahead and move that inward two. Uh, maybe, maybe just move it one. I think that'll work just fine. So we'll go ahead and move one, uh, bring this down, leave a gap right there. Oops, wrong block. So we'll leave a gap. Yeah, that looks it looks a little better. The shape is more noticeable and it makes more sense, I believe. So just a visual thing. So we're gonna go ahead and put some black uh, slabs here. Now this isn't gonna copy over. We're gonna have to do this manually, but I think this will look pretty cool if we just put some black slabs, kind of in like a cyberpunk looking feel right there. Let's go ahead and put that right there. Just mess with the leg a little bit, try to make it just a teeny bit better looking. So there we go. There we go. I think I think that'll be fine for now because I want to want to move on to different things. I've, I've been on this leg for like the past hour, but let's go ahead and see us rotate this. Maybe four times. Let's try eight. It's it's probably gonna be too much, but we'll just try eight and we'll see what it looks like. That actually looks pretty pretty cool. Uh, but it might be it might be too much. Uh, maybe not though. We're just gonna leave it right there. How about that? We'll just leave it right there. I think it's pretty cool like it is, uh, whatever. And then we're gonna do, we're gonna actually add onto it a little bit. Let's do this right here, cause this will actually be the grav, the anti-grav. Cause we don't use propulsion engines here. We, you know, we're high future. We use anti-gravity machines. We don't need, 
We don't need to use gasoline or anything like that. We have anti-grab machines. So let's go ahead and put an anti-grab machine right there. It doesn't have to look like anything really. It just has to look like something futuristic, you know. And then let's go back up here. Let's go ahead and set our home um, up here because we're going to probably be here a lot. So we're going to set our home there. And we're going to see us rotate that eight more times. And that will have the anti-grab machine all the way around it. So that, that'll look pretty cool. So the... The um, the 90 degree angles are fine, so we're just gonna have to fix the 45 degree angles a little bit. They look a little funky, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, blocks are missing and stuff, so we're just gonna build it all up a little bit, give it some more structuring, that kind of thing. So I'm gonna lay out. I'm gonna fix these legs. I'm gonna lay out most of it um, on a time lapse, uh, and then once I I think I've done enough to explain to you guys what I'm doing. I will come back. So enjoy the time lapse, and this is going to be a crazy rocket, so it's going to be really fast, and I'm going to be speed running through most of it. So keep your eyes peeled for any techniques you guys want to learn. So I will be right back. Enjoy the time lapse.
ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, feast your eyes on the spaceship for hackers. The Hacka Nebuchadnezzar, I guess I'll call it. I'll just call it the Nebuchadnezzar because I love the Matrix, if you guys are familiar with the Nebuchadnezzar. So anyways, this is completed uh well the uh the ex the uh you know the exterior anyways um i was sorry for the really long time lapse i kind of just blacked out and just started grinding like thing uh, actually this needs to be connected better what the heck i need to fix something actually um but yeah anyways we are going to make the interior now which is the juicy fun part which i saved for you guys so we're gonna pop into this thing and i'll show you how much space we have to work with inside because it's actually i mean it's actually pretty big uh, inside because I have these things right here like these domes you see if you open up there's like pretty decent amount of space I'm not sure cuz I mean a spaceship is meant to be like no gravity there's so there's no like up or down So we're gonna have to figure out how to do that uh, Properly, uh, but let's go ahead and figure out where the I guess the space docking door should be probably down here so Technically the door should be I, I can't flip it. It should be that way I can't like flip my screen obviously, but if you guys just tilt your head, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's supposed to be good. The door is supposed to be up and down going this way But anyways, we're gonna make it just for the video. We're just gonna make it right here You know, you know, we're in Minecraft so it can't be too realistic Although I could rotate this 90 degrees to the right and actually do the interior, but it's alright I'm not gonna do that. That's, that would require a lot of math and a lot of uh, engineering that I don't want to go into right now But let's go ahead and grab some metal and we're gonna make the front entrance door right here So let's go ahead and I guess we can make some glass out of it too. Maybe some green reinforced glass So let's go ahead and grab some metal uh, Right there or iron anyways, and then boom we have our front door doo -doo -doo -doo. Welcome to the middle of the space station and then up here we have the engine I believe so yeah this is the top so this is the engine so we're gonna bring the engine down like this and we're gonna have the entrance be you have to like walk around the engine I guess all right where is this door there's the door so the door is right here let's go ahead and add a floor uh, let's add a four runner floor and let's make it this four runner kind of 1282 block would be pretty cool because I think this does light up does it yes it does light up yes this looks epic all right so let's go ahead and bring the engine all the way down and then obviously put a, uh, a barrier around it so people don't walk into it and get vaporized, but we'll do that right now. Uh, how far do I got to go? Okay, I'll just stack this down. Grab the selection right here. And then we're gonna stack this maybe like six times. Six, seven. Bingo! And then we'll just make a, a little barrier around it. That way people just don't walk right up into it, you know? I, I'm pretty sure Cody would do something like that, so we're gonna go ahead and slope that um, off. So let's go ahead and put a slope right here. So this is the engine room. Uh, this is where I guess I could put the computers and everything that like monitors the engine. Because uh, I don't really know. I mean, it's just a, it's just a random science engine. There's no like science behind it really, but it's just like something in the future, you know. So let's go ahead and grab a table here. And obviously we're gonna make the door down right here uh, because obviously in space there are no such things as up and down, and there's no doors, so you can just float around wherever you want. Um, but let's go ahead and grab this stained white glass panel. So this is actually where people would get down. Um, to maintenance, I guess this could be maintenance ports. So we can go ahead and put glass around it. Um, just because we want to close this in so people don't like, you know, have to get into a spacesuit just to walk down here. Oh, uh, we got to have airlocks too. Airlocks are pretty cool on spaceships. So let's go ahead and fill this in with glass, make it not too noticeable on the exterior. It doesn't really affect the design too much. So, and then we're going to have mechanism down here. Uh, mechanism block, security, sure that, sure why not that. Mm -hmm, yep, that too. Oh yeah, all, all the things, all the things. So we're going to have put mechanism right here. Uh, put a computer monitoring system right here. We'll put like a radar. This radar can go uh, like right here. It could be pretty cool. Just maintenance ports. Just maintenance ports things, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so let's go ahead and put the electric chamber right there. We'll put another computer monitor system right there. Do we have a solar panel? Ooh, we do have a solar panel. So we're going to put a solar neutron divider or whatever the heck that thing was <laughs> right there. So maintenance ports. Awesome. Uh, so let's go down here now. Can we make that? How big can we make that the carpenter trap door? A sliding trap door. Can we make this like all the way? Oh man, that would be so cool if we could. Uh, but maybe we could just use a vanishing block. So we'll go ahead and put a vanishing block right here. We'll make it iron or something. Uh, make it uh, actually. I want some steel in here. Let's go ahead and grab some steel. So this will be the maintenance ports. So let's go ahead and put a lever right there to open it. Just a basic Minecraft lever. We ain't gonna do anything crazy. Uh, maybe put it like right here. There we go. So let's put a sign that says maintenance ports. 
uh, down here. We'll throw that away so we can type maintenance port. Doesn't have to be anything crazy, just something quick. <laughs> so, uh, right. So, anyways, here's the engine. Let's do some tables around here, like glass tables. We got maybe because mm, uh, we, we definitely need some computers, um, screens and stuff. So we'll go ahead and put a screen, and we'll just put a bunch of a bunch of computers right here to make it look like people work on the thing right here. And I don't think, do chairs exist in space? Probably not. So we're going to go ahead and gl close that. Now upstairs is going to be, how, how, do, how do they get upstairs? Oh god. <laughs> they have an engine between them uh, and the upstairs. Uh, maybe a, a portal <laughs> that just takes them up there. <laughs> and it spawns them in the crew quarters. So I guess, oh never mind. We, to get to the crew quarters, to get to the engine maintenance port, you have to maybe spacewalk down. Uh, into this door right here, and then we can just not even make a uh, not even make a door. That'll be the easiest way, I think, because then we can just make another door for the crew quarters. Um, so let's go ahead and grab the garage door, and we'll just make the crew quarters all the way up here, and then where they like steer and stuff. Oh yeah, right here, the perfect spot for it. Boom, right there. Yeah. So put the garage door. We'll put some steel, and we'll put some glow, glow, glowy, glowy stuff in there as well. Glowy, glowy, right there. Boom. And we have our crew quarters ready to be made. And we also have our uh, our, uh, our our space deck, I guess you could say. So let's go ahead and fill this in with something. Probably that 4-runner block because it's really awesome. 1282. 30. Oh, that wasn't, that wasn't the data value. What was the data value? 4-runner. Uh, 30 was this block. It was 1282. Oh, 12, okay, there we go. 12, 82, 30. There we go. That should work. Perfection. So let's go ahead and make the door right here. Obviously, a door is a very loose term I use right there. It's more of just a hole. So let's go ahead and wrap this around here. And I wish I could do the interior more and I can I could rotate the spaceship and make it really cool, but we are stretched on time. So it's all right. Nope. So storage will be down here and we'll make another forerunner uh, right here. No, not that one. Oops. 1282.30. That's what I meant to do. 1282.30. There we go. So, boom. We have this going on. Uh, let's put a door down here that they have to walk through or float through, I guess. And then that'll be pretty much pretty much it. We just need crew quarters and a spaceship or a thing. Here's storage down here so we can put a bunch of safes and crates down here. Uh, nothing that's gonna look futuristic or anything. Oh, this actually looks futuristic. We'll put that down there. This as well. So we'll, we'll put a bunch of crates right here down here. Oh yeah, now we're talking about now we're talking about futuristic looking. Yeah, we got the Star Wars stuff in here. That's pretty cool looking. Uh, maybe there's, there's some other Star Warsy stuff I can have in here that look pretty cool. Oh yeah, I forgot about this stuff. Let's throw all this stuff up here in the maintenance ports. That would be insane. So let's go ahead. Now that we have the storage done. Let's go ahead and just add more crates down here, and then we'll put like the little white blocks around, because th this will be like people's uh, people's crates or something that they just have floating down here, because <laughs> it's space. People just float. Uh, let's remove these and remove this bottom block right here. Delete that. Finish that. We'll just do this right here so we can move easily. Um, so, uh, bed. Now we need a bed, and beds in space are pretty, uh, they're usually on the wall, like usually just lean up against the wall and kind of just fall asleep. Um, I wish you could do that in Minecraft, but obviously you cannot. Uh, so we're just going to put beds all around this upper ring of black uh, metal right here. So let's go ahead and grab the carpenter's bed, and we'll just put beds pretty much everywhere. <laughs> I think that'll look pretty funny. This is where everyone has a giant sleepover. That's pretty cool. So there we go. Let's finish off this uh, ledge right here, and then we'll be good. Oh, what is this? What? I just tried to go to sleep in Mars, and it just exploded. <laughs> oh, confirmed. Do not go to sleep in Mars, or you will die. Confirmed. All right, so let's go ahead and fix that a little bit. Uh, let's build this up right here. I think this is how it was. Uh, and then put the black stuff back right here. Um, that should be all right for the time being. Close that in. All my beds are dead. That's crazy how it exploded. Oh, geez, that was scary, actually. I was like, oops, I just deleted my entire build, but nope, thankfully it didn't do that much. Okay, don't delete the bed. Don't delete the bed. I almost clicked on it there again. <laughs> so, all right. Okay, this is just like... Okay, somewhere I messed up. Oh, God, I got to delete that bed. Uh, 
We'll just put that there. Whatever, no one sees that, <laughs> okay? Uh, so let's go ahead and put some computers and stuff down here. This is where everyone works on the ship. Yada, yada, yada. Just completely random. Doesn't need to be any kind of cool looking pattern or anything. There we go. So everyone works on the ship there. Now, the spaceship. So let's go ahead and look at Star Wars. We have the flight control center somewhere. Here it is, command center. There we go. And we have all these cool little lights. And here's another command center. And that should be pretty good. So let's go ahead and throw the command centers down here. This is where they steer the ship. Now we need a chair. We need a futuristic looking chair. How about this white one right here? Boom, that looks pretty cool. So let's put that right there. Put that right there. Remember, this is high fantasy. It doesn't have to have anything realistic looking. <laughs> so let's go ahead and finish this up just with a little command center right here. And then we are pretty much done, ladies and gentlemen. Let me fly through here. Oh man, this is cool. Where's the door? Oh god, I missed the door. Clear inventory. Oh, there we go. So, hope you guys enjoy the build. I'm going to wait for them to get done. And uh, we're going to show off our build, see what they think about it. And then we're going to check out the other threes uh, after the quick transition right now. So, see you in a second. Later. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Elon Musk here, back for another Minecraft video. Or as I should say, Minecraft meme review. <laughs> All right, guys, so we finished building. It's time to look at these bases. The noob, a.k.a. Kraken Kid, is uh, taking us to his base, and he's, he's very excited to show us. Okay, okay, so, you guys, you know the, the childhood the childhood rhyme, right? Girls yeah. go to college to get more knowledge. Boys go to... Pluto. Pluto. To get more stupid, though. Yeah. We used Jupiter. to go to Jupiter to get more stupid. Boys go now. to Mars to get more bars. Fire. Or Candy bars! It was close enough, Cody. So, uh, <laughs> I decided to build a Mars candy bar. Uh, it's the actual wrapper right Oh, here. I thought Mars. this was a doo-doo. A Mars doo-doo. It is a Mars candy bar. <laughs> this is awful, dude. What was this dude doing here? What you selling, bro? What you selling? It's the noob of the Whoa, day. What are you okay. selling? <laughs> Just come down over here to the M, okay? Could you has winners if you have coin. You are going to learn the anatomy of a Mars candy bar real quick. Okay. Come right on in. Ah, oh, I see Elon Musk's face. This is right here. You have the beautiful, the majestic, the soft, cartel? Okay. fluffy chocolate malt nougat. This is the oh. center. It is the inside, the creaminess. Milk and chocolate. And then on top of that, you have the golden layer of caramel. Yeah, I don't like this. It's so juicy. This makes and me kind of queasy. This of course, it is all wrapped in together in the milk chocolate crust, as you see over here. <laughs> Completely surrounds the entire bar. And then we have the bathrooms over here. This literally looks like what I took in the Wait, bathroom just... like 10 minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like he was saying, oh, why aren't you guys finished your build? Like, why aren't you done yet? Literally that, this is why. You can take a, build, a poop. Hacker, hack away the wrapper, please. Hack away the wrapper. Uh, Hack away uh, the wrapper. Okay. Uh, okay, so as you can see, it's it is literally... a beautiful looking candy bar. Still a poo. It's a tad <laughs> bit bigger than what I did in the bathroom earlier. <laughs> <laughs> That's accurate size. The, I like it. I like it. It was uh, definitely a unique presentation. Are you, you saying you didn't eat this? I, I'm gonna go with a no dog. Since you can literally, there's plumbing inside of it. I don't think I'm gonna step in. Where does the poop go from the toilet? Okay. Anyways, so now we move on to mine. Welcome to Mars Dropolis. You head right into the airlock system. Actually, before you do, we can take a look at the heat shield that I did add in and the meteor shield. Ooh. So basically, there's solar panels in the back that can eat up some of the rays, and these will protect the glass from uh, falling meteors that uh, apparently drop a lot. Where does the poop go from the rays? We just send it into space. Anyway, yeah, we use a rocket every once in a while. You can come right inside, bang a left, and you guys can go around and make your way to the center. Whee! I'm not sure if it was supposed to be a lab or this is where, where we're going to sleep and stuff, but we have two floors, uh, one and two. Ooh. Y'all cool. left the airlock open. So it's all hollowed out. It's the other airlocks. Oh my god, you guys are idiots. Like I was saying, like this system is fail proof, except for like if an idiot leaves one of the airlocks open and yeah, what if we what just, if we're just like Yeah, I, I think I, I think I'm lost. <laughs> yeah it's not uh, it's not uh, really um, 
idiot proof. Anyway, so yeah, that's my uh, Marsopolis. I was gonna build a lot more, but I had to build it with the terrain, and I think it came out cool, but it took forever. Oh my god. Oh yeah, definitely can't world edit that. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Wait, what is this? Is this Geo Dude? Oh no, it's a meteor. G Dude, it. Oh, these Dude, are D uh, Douglas, Diglets. <laughs> All right, Mister Hacker, All right, what man. did you build? Make oh your guys, make your way, <laughs> Josh. Sorry, stop, I was playing. Stop, stop hey, is this a rocket transformer? Over. Anyways, this is how we get to the Andromeda Galaxy uh, via the hack, the Hacka Hacka hack Nebuchadnezzar, I think is what it's called. I feel like Some kind of cool. No, it's from the Matrix, okay? Uh, um, but anyways, this is how we get to the Dremoda Galaxy because I decided Mars was too lame and I don't like having no gravity, so I wanted to leave, but I didn't want to go back to Earth, so I wanted to go really, 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 really far What's away. What's the blue thing in the middle? Is it like the, a core? The blue thing in the middle is where the energy is shot down into the nuclear core right here, and this actually allows a dark matter I feel like to be one emanated. asteroid field and this thing's gone. <laughs> oh, well, the dark matter it emanates in a natural um, <laughs> meteor field. Oh, there's, a, there's an interior inside, boys. I'm in. I'm in. Do you know what it kind of looks yeah, like? Which one are you in? Okay, you're, yeah, like you're the, in the control center. Oh, yeah. It, okay, it looks like the spaceship from, you know that movie, The Passengers? Uh, Never seen it. Nope. Where it's like those two people, like like the big spaceship with all the people that they put to sleep. Where they're going oh, to my gosh, amazing. Oh, Sounds with, like uh, every with, space uh, movie uh, ever. Uh, with uh, Katniss Everdeen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and then the, like those two people wake up because they're supposed to fix the ship. Hmm. Oh yeah, gotcha, gotcha. Anyway, <laughs> if you go to like the very, very bottom, here I'll go to it so you guys can TP. Uh, where is the door? It's somewhere here, I promise. It's the, you know it's just so big and uh, so impressive that it's hard to find. Okay, TP to me. Oh yeah, the door right here. This is the access panel to the engine maintenance. So engine who's maintenance. been in here? But if you open maintenance that up, ports. You, can, you can get down. We're to the, now uh, deactivating the, missiles, sending get down to it the to Mars. And stuff, you know? You're just destroying everything. Now my rocket's right. never. My We're rocket. Right. Elon Musk just broken through the window. Yo, it's Elon like, Musk, but like the Kool Aid Man. Are you jealous, <laughs> Elon Musk? Huh? Yeah, oh. too, too futuristic for you. All right, let's make our way over to the Minecraft God. And what did you make? I mean, okay, hold on. <laughs> I can explain. The rocket, I'm actually kind of proud of, but the car. The car is dope. Looks like something like SpongeBob. It does. That's what, exactly what I'm I I'm driving it. <laughs> what the heck? You're actually sitting down, dude. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you drive a car. <laughs> I mean, it looks like a sleigh more than anything else. Yeah. I know. I mean, Rudolph is the rocket. <laughs> I like it, dude. Yeah, I mean, I, I spent a lot of time on it. I used carpenter blocks, which is the first. Oh, one. you got the USA? Like, oh, that's actually pretty cool, dude. You did a good job. Where's the door? There, there is no interior because the only there's a door. What do you mean? It's the car's right here, man. Yeah, oh, I found the it. interior. It's full yeah. of air. Ah, oh, he's using air as a propulsion device. I, I like it. <laughs> It'll take us at least ten years to get there with no gas. <laughs> Out of the atmosphere, yeah. <laughs> well, this is Mars, guys, and this is what we built. Comment down below right now. Do you think the new pro, hacker, or god has won this video? 5,000 likes get you another episode with the Minecraft god, a.k.a. Elon Musk, a.k.a. Baby Blooper, a.k.a. Holy crap, he's got a nuke! Good job! This is Vote the for the hacker. Company. This is what we do.